Hey guys, welcome to part 2 of uh, how to paint the Warhammer 40k rocky terrain that I made earlier in the video, the part 1 video. It's at the top left of the uh, video, click that link to go to part 1. So first off, you're going to want to paint the whole thing black. That's going to be your base coat for your sand. You don't want to touch the rocks though with that black because as you can see here, you're going to want to paint the rocks brown. The brown is going to be the base color for the rocks, and the black is going to be the base color for the sand, and you're going to expand on top of that. So, I used, I actually used a blow dryer to, uh, to make my paints dry faster, but you don't have to. But, uh, it doesn't really matter if you get the brown on the black. So, now this is the part where the magic happens. It's called dry brushing. Dry brushing is when you get a little bit of paint on your brush and then swipe it across and then it only hits the raised edges. If you don't know what dry brushing is. But what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to dry brush the whole thing a bleach bone color. Now I found this color, it was like an ivory color at Michael's uh, art, art supply store. You can just buy that or you could actually use bleach bone. So now you just saw what it should look like. So now we're going to add some turf from Army Painter. Um, I use super glue to apply this. Normally you should use Elmer's, but I was in a rush. So I also applied some um, razor wire from Army Painter also. This is nice because it's actually real wire, which even make that makes it look awesome. So what you're gonna also want to do here, you're gonna add some static grass. You just add some Elmer's glue in random patches and then throw down static grass. Um, static grass is kind of like small blades of green uh, material I guess you could say and you blow on it and it stands up like real grass so it looks pretty awesome. So right here I'm just touching up all the little bits that I put on like the lads gun, the knife in the rock, and the ammo box. Um, but really this is just about it. You're about to see what it should look like. And here you see what it should look like. So uh, you can see here how the dry brushing really picked out the edges and how the little like turfs of grass that we added really makes everything stand out. Um, the razor wire, I, I should have put a wash on to make it look weathered, but I didn't. But all in all, it's a nice piece of quick terrain. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. So don't forget, please subscribe, watch my videos, it really helps me. And there you go. Thank you for watching.